Hi, my name is Stephanie, and I'm an applied ecology student. Today, it is my honor to talk to you about D Dr. Gary Polis, who will be awarded with a Lifetime Achievement Award. I'll talk to you about his famous ideas, his experiments, and today's implications of his ideas. So, Dr. Gary Polis looked at the energy flow through food webs, particularly spatial subsidy. Spatial subsidy is the idea that a donor from one habitat can increase the productivity of a recipient habitat. He, most importantly, helped to quantify the magnitude of subsidy effects. His exper experiments, one of his experiments, happened in Baja, California, where he looked at marine algae and carrions washed on shore and how these subsidies supported the scavenging communities of insects along the shoreline. Furthermore, he looked at how the marine subsidy of, of seabird guano increased local primary primary production, and the nutrient content of the plants in the area. He later found that these subsidiary effects went all the way up the food web, in, in do, um, causing effects on the abundance and behavior of higher level consumers, such as coyotes and scorpions. These uh, ideas of subsidy effects are still in place today. So he helped to understand that subsidies are important in adjacent systems. So two systems right next to each other have the subsidies have a high um, importance in the system next to it. He also overall helped to understand the importance of landscape ecology in understanding the broader food web dynamics. So congratulations to Dr. Gary Polis, who is awarded a Lifetime Achievement award based on his ideas of quantifying the magnitude of subsidy effects.